chairperson, a sovereign ratings downgrade would be a disaster for South Africa. One prominent economist believed that a ratings downgrade would trigger a recession and a loss of 200,000 more jobs in South Africa, which of course makes it so difficult to understand why President Jacob Zuma and the wreckers who support him would make a ratings downgrade more likely by launching a full-scale political assault on the Minister of Finance, Praveen Gordon, deliberately generating headlines screeching Praveen arrest shock. What is worse is that the recent assurance from Hawke's boss, Bernie Clemeza, and national prosecuting boss, Sean Abrahams, that the finance minister would not be arrested were cold comfort. Listen carefully. What Bernie Nklemeza actually said was that the finance minister had nothing to fear, pause, at this stage. And what Sean Abrahams actually said was that the minister would not be charged, pause, with espionage. What he actually said was that the investigation was ongoing and that if charges were preferred, including charges against the finance minister, he would make the final decision. What this means is that President Jacob Zuma and the wreckers who support him sitting over there will stop at nothing, including making a sovereign ratings downgrade more likely in South Africa.